Okay, Jamie and family, here is three black duck in Sea Pines Plantation, Hilton Head, South Carolina. Foreclosure, nice driveway to the left, and your garage is down there. And you come in the house from there, and from the outside, you walk up, it's a nice stone tile entranceway. Coming up to a very grand entranceway. Your wrought iron, your outdoor pool. Very nice deck, low maintenance house, especially for a rental property. Nice lead glass door as your front entrance. I love the wood in your ceiling over the deck. This is all a covered porch, all hard coat stucco. Showing you here how nice a veranda you have. Again, covered with the wood above, stone tile below. Here's your outdoor pool with hot tub. And then the deck wraps around downstairs. And out here, Jamie, you are wondering what you see only on this side, which is not the main part of the house. Mostly pine trees and a little bit of the parking area over there through the palm trees. This is not the main parking area. That's down by the Monarch and the golf course. This is Tower Beach. That gives you an idea of what you see. Very pretty covered veranda, covered porch. Double doors, which you could open up in the spring, summer, and fall. Listen to the pool, have kids swim out here. Really a nice, comfortable layout for family, but very elegant. Come in your main front door. Come right into the family room downstairs. And amazingly, in a foreclosure, they've also left you all this furniture. So from what I understand, this does transfer. And this is decent, especially for a rental property. A little wet bar downstairs with some built-in cabinets. Set up looking right out to the pool. Give you a view from this side. That's out to the pool. Then here's your view back into the living room. Again, set up double master suite, master bedroom down, the master bedroom on the second floor. Kitchen and living room are upstairs. Here's your master bedroom down. Doors going right out to the pool and the patio. Huge walk in closet. Then you go back here into your Double vanity, travertine, stone and tile. Really a very pretty layout. Large, nice master bath. Glass walk-in shower. And your tile floors. Double doors, got into your tile hallway. You have a laundry room down with the washer and dryer, of course. And then a full bath down for people in the family room. Guest bedroom down here has twin beds set up. Might need just a little TV down here. Doors that open up out to the pool and the patio. And then another full bath attached to the guest bedroom. Nice wide hallways in the home. Really a much better house than Three Pixie. Three Pixie I like because of the location on the golf course. And your steps up to the living room and kitchen. 
This one has nice high ceilings. I want the video will be able to show you how open and large the room is. I'll give you a nice panorama here, show you sitting area for your TV and fireplace. Pan around, nice deck that you can go out to overlooking the pool. That's a big curved window and atrium around your dining area. Granite countertops and tile floors in the kitchen with all your appliances. Flows around to your breakfast area. Your stairwell coming up. Master bedroom and guest room back there. So that gives you a good idea of the layout up here. This is very pretty. I don't know if it shows on the video, but this is really a pretty dining area. The curved architecture. Give you a nice panorama here too. Very, very large room, very high ceilings. Beautiful crown molding throughout. We'll go out on the veranda here. It's also covered with your wood above and your stone tile. And there's some granite tile tables, chairs, a little barbecue grill. Again, your deck. And again, this looks out toward your parking lot. I mean, you see just a little bit through the trees as it really doesn't seem to be anything that would be obtrusive to rentals or to sales. And here's looking down on your pool and hot tub and your second row ocean. So that house is oceanfront. A lot of trees between you and your neighbors next door, so you really don't see the houses next door to you. I mean, it needs some maintenance. You, you need to stain the wood. You need to clean the house up. The doors need to be restained. I mean, the maintenance on this house has been left, and so it really does need some some upkeep. But nothing major that I can see. Not had a home inspector go through, so I don't know exactly what all needs to be done. But everything seems to be functioning. All the lights are on. The appliances seem to be running. What I'm here with the refrigerator, so. But we do get a 10 day home inspection on the foreclosure and your stairwell down. Nice wood stairwell, so nice layout, very open. Very comfortable though for an elegant home. Very high ceilings. Again, this is your master bedroom upstairs. So you have a double master suite. Fireplace in the bedroom. In this price home, I would definitely buy some nice new TVs. The 1980 box TV's got to go. But that's my, my personal preferences. I think most people renting a million dollar home and TVs are so cheap. So those might be a few things you might want to do. Then your master bath upstairs. Hot tub. Again, a stone shower. And then your walk-in closet. Showing you your vanity, double vanity in the master bedroom. High ceilings, crown molding. It's really a nice layout and a beautiful home, guys. Please let me know what you think. This is three black duck in Sea Pines in Hilton Head, South Carolina. Oh, wait a minute, sorry. There's one more guest bedroom back here. <laughs> I might replace this with a bigger bed, since it's on the main floor, or put in bunk beds for kids. Occupancy is money and rentals. So you might want to throw set of bunk beds or two sets of bunk beds in here but definitely a king or a queen in here would be nice and then getting back out to your living room and that gives you your layout clearly on the rental projections the owner used the property last year I guess they knew it was going into foreclosure 
so they used it for almost all the summer and didn't really make any money but I think you should be doing a hundred thousand plus on this house in gross rentals and with Hilton Head Vacations and HiltonHeadLuxuryVacations.com we can easily get this rented for you guys give me a call look forward to talking with you again three black duck in sea pines right near what I do like about this is you're right near South Beach so you can walk to South Beach Marina Salty Dog and your second row ocean and you bite to Harbor Town so really a great great location for a lot